So now I've wired up the Bluetti with some proper wiring now and covers, except for the cover on the sub panel here is not on yet, but I've been testing running the air conditioning with Bluetti. It's been working well. So this is the transfer switch on the top box. The mains is off, but the solar is on, the solar breaker's on. The Bluetti's charging with 300 watts coming in because it's cloudy outside, we've just had rain. The air conditioner at the moment is uh, throttled down to 85 watts because it's reached the set temperature. And I've got the solar sub panel set up. So I've got a breaker for the solar and I've got a over voltage protector, the one in the red let numbers showing 230 volts. And then I've got a meter from Peacefair. That one is showing um, the volts, the amps, the watts, and the units of electricity. So I've been running the uh, solar all afternoon. The battery has actually come down to 18% because it's been a very hot day. And if I show you the panel, this is a meter on the right from Peacefair, which has shown that I've used 4.2 units of electricity, 4.2 kilowatt hours. So solar in through this breaker into a Bluetti AC200. There's a plug going into my sub panel and then it goes on to the other sub panel with the switch, the automatic transfer switch. And you can see the top light is red. That means the solar is on. Uh, the the top left breaker is mains grid, so there's no mains grid coming in. It's all on the solar today. So you can run an air conditioner. This has been running for almost five hours and it's running fine. And I've still got to put the cover on, but I just wanted to show you the RCBO, then an over voltage protector and a, well, basically just a meter showing the volts, watts, amps and the kilowatt hours total. So very happy with this. The cover is going to go on next. And that is the solar setup for my tiny house.